I found that bowl of guavas. But if you give one to that parrot, stand back. She loves them. How's it going? I followed the directions on the kidnapper's note and dug up El Toro's old journal. Does it tell you where the treasure is? I think so. You think so? The problem is, the journal's in code. I've decoded some of it, but not all of it. Always a catch. I drove out to Sangre Beach. Any sign of Bess? Well, I found her golf cart, empty, and I saw one of her shoes. And then I discovered that a fisherman named Johnny Roll is camping there. He's kind of a beach bum. He's also very paranoid. You found one of her shoes on the same beach as a paranoid beach bum? I don't like the sound of that. Does he know anything about Bess? He says he doesn't, but I'm not sure I believe him. I don't blame you. Some fisherman just happens to be camping on the very beach where Bess disappears? That's way too much of a coincidence for me. He says he's seen other people on the island, unfriendly people. He could just be saying that to divert attention from himself. Without even meeting this guy, I don't like him and I don't trust him. I think we... Okay, you should keep an eye on him. Did you know you can play games with the monkeys here on the island? I read that they were taught to play games. You've actually played a game with them? And won, although it wasn't easy. They even gave me a prize, which turned out to be something they'd pilfered. They steal things, huh? Wonder what human taught them that. I'll see you later. Keep me posted. Hi, Cuckoo. Wow, what an elaborate perch. Cuckoo love perch. Wanna see a trick? What's the catch? A trick for a treat, a trick for a treat. Quid pro quo. And by treat, you mean... Fruit! Cuckoo wants fruit! 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 Okay, okay, I get the picture. Just so we're clear, if I give you some fruit, you'll do a trick? You got it, sister. I've got a treat here, so how about a trick? Treat first! Treat first! Cuckoo want treat first! Boy, howdy, that was good. Prepare to be amazed! <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Ha, ha, ha. 
What is it now? I retrieved your beacon for you. Here you go. Good. And here is your battery. Thank you. That is all? Guess I'll be going. Do not hurry back. That looks right, but I still need a battery. Looks like this thing needs a battery. One full tank of air coming up. We are definitely not alone on this island. Are you alright? You sound weird. I've been hearing footsteps, like people creeping around outside. They're always gone by the time I go to look, but after a while I'll hear them again, and it's starting to get to me. Does it sound like several people, or just one? Several people. Maybe it's the kidnappers. Look, even if it is, and you still don't know that for a fact, you can't let it stop you from working on that phone. Calling for help may be the only way we're going to get off this island. You're right. I'm acting like an idiot. From now on, no matter what I hear outside, I'm just going to ignore it and focus. Although if you could somehow make the noises stop, I'd really appreciate it. Have you talked to the parrot over there? Yeah, but it acts like it doesn't like me. I think it's related to a parrot I met over in England. Is that good or bad? I'm not sure. With both of them, their favorite thing seems to be eating. But if you feed it a guava, this one will do tricks. Really? Maybe I'll try talking to it again. I figured out how to work the sailboat so I can get to all the places mentioned in El Toro's journal. I've never been big on sailing. All those ropes and winches and halyard things. But you know who absolutely adores sailing? Bess. I mean, getting kidnapped is bad enough, but missing out on sailing in the Bahamas? Boy, is she gonna be ticked. In order to follow the clues in El Toro's journal, I've had to do some scuba diving. Scuba diving? Are you nuts? With all the sharks around here? George, contrary to what the movies would have you believe, sharks rarely attack humans. Especially when they live in a healthy ecosystem like this, where they have lots of real fish to eat. If I don't bother them, they're not going to bother me. Are you sure? Positive. Well, still. If a shark gets too close, you just pretend it's one of the kidnappers and punch it right in the nose. I'd better get back to work. You know where to find me. Who wants to go? 
no shark diving. to go shark diving. There, all decoded. All right, whoever you are, I get the picture. I've seen a metal rod that height. The one Cuckoo the Parrot is perched on. That's a really interesting perch you've got there, Cuckoo. Nice perch, nice perch. Cuckoo love perch. Yeah, well, the thing is, I kind of need it. Look, how about I trade you that perch for an even nicer one? Treat for trade, treat for trade. Cuckoo want fruit, 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 fruit. <sighs> Why am I not surprised? I've got a treat here. Now, what kind of new perch would you like? 
first! Cheat first! Sweet! Cuckoo on driftwood! You want a piece of driftwood for a perch? Driftwood for perch! Driftwood for perch! Ah! See you later, Cuckoo!